Looky here, y'all. What? Lancaster blower number four. Champion Forge and Company. Nice ash dump. Clinker breaker. So as you see, this needs a little bit of work, but that's okay. Then it goes up, and then I installed that. So now, smoke's gonna be going out the top of my tent <laughs> instead of inside of my tent, which I'll still use this one. And this one. All right, so I'll, I do want to apologize for the noise in the background because we do live next to the freeway. So therefore, hey, it's a little noisy outside, but I wanted to show you this forge because I so like it says in the title, right? It's a win-win for all veterans. And the reason why I say that is because I actually picked this up from a retired Navy veteran of 24 years. Okay, even though he's a bubblehead, I still love him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hey, it's between you know us topsiders and, and the, the bottom feeders, right? But hey, he's still a brethren, and brother, I love you. So, the deal with this forge, okay, it's not mine. It's not Gladys's, okay? This is still his forge. So the thing is, right, he lived in like a not so nice neighborhood right here in the, the Hampton Roads area of Virginia. Yes, right? We do have some bad areas, just like everywhere, okay? He just got tired of, you know, listening to the gunshots and having stuff like that going on, right? And he's a disabled veteran. He wanted to go move out by the lakes, right? Being retired, doing the fishing life, doing that retired life. And as of right now, he cannot forge with some of the stuff that's going on, all right? With his, his health and his, his lifestyle. So I reached out to them as they were selling this because they're moving right they were selling this i couldn't afford to buy it but i i asked if i could do a payment plan and i told them what was going on what we're doing here vets help, helping vets and that you know i'm giving back to the community of helping out our veterans our brothers and our sisters learning the art of blacksmithing and i reached out to him i talked to him for a little bit right because i did talk about the mission 22 stuff i did talk about some of the other things they're not really savvy on some of that things because a lot of associations right a lot of the nonprofits say they're nonprofit, but yet they make a lot of money right so hey it's not for everybody so i'm not holding that against him if he's not wanting to give money you know to a nonprofit, but he is willing to give out to us or to, to loan his stuff to us because we're not a nonprofit. I'm just a retired Navy veteran giving back to our veteran community. I'm not asking for money, right? Once I start making money on YouTube, we're going to be utilizing the money that we make to give back to the veteran community. Okay? Obviously, if people give us a donation, it goes right back into the shop, but I'm not asking for it. Okay? I'm a, not a nonprofit organization, okay? I'm not an organization or anything like that. Neither is Gladys, right? We're just two military veterans wanting to give back to our community. And Joey is the same way. So he, he really liked uh, what was going on, you know, and this forge is his. So any repairs, anything that we're doing, right? He's going to give the money to do the repairs on this. And he even already threw in, you know, a little bit of cash to be able to fix up and, and do the stuff that I needed to do to it right now to be that way it's tip top, that way I can start using it. All right, and then he also has this post vise. So you can see it's missing the spring, it's missing the, the mounting, right? So you can see like on mine, right? I have the little mount there. So I'm basically gonna do the same thing that I have on mine for this one here. Okay, so that's the, I can easily make that. I have the stuff that I need to do, all right? But we got us another post vise. And then I also have another forge pot over here, all right? And this thing, this one's nice. So I'll be able to make my other forge whenever I get the, uh, the blacksmith shop up and running. And this is the one I'm gonna be utilizing whenever I do that forge build into the new blacksmith shop. All right, so Joey, Missy, 
brother, I love you. Okay? Just know that I'm going to be taking care of your stuff and we are going to be helping out quite a few veterans, hopefully, right? I'm putting out the word. I've been putting out the word. I'm just waiting for them to come, right? It's one of those things. You build it, they will come. I still got to get the blacksmith shop built, but hey, I can forge underneath the tent, so can they, all right? So I got the forges. I got the anvils. Once they're ready to start coming in, hey, I'm ready to start teaching. Okay, and with this video that's coming out, right? Because I also need to do a Beard Up Challenge video, so I'm going to be doing that after dinner. All right, but y'all, we're over a thousand subscribers. So in this video, I want you to comment down below, congratulations, or I'm in, or hey, whatever. I'm not gonna have anything that you need to go do, all right, to be part of the giveaway. Now, what's gonna be part of the giveaway? Well, First off, I'm going to be making a blacksmith item of my choosing, and I guarantee you, you're going to like it. All right, so whenever it comes time to uh, pick the winner, you're going to see what that item is. And then we also have a couple of paintings that Gladys has already done. Okay, they're they're a matched set, and they're they're pretty good sized paintings. Okay. All right, so leave your comment below. Give us a thumbs up if you guys wouldn't mind. Click that bell for any notifications because you're definitely going to want a notification on uh, whoever wins, okay? And yeah, that, that's it. Tell a veteran that you love them, and uh, we'll see you all in the next one. All right, bye-bye now.